Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is another panning project update. And this is for the Advent Calendar Project Pan. My name is Kim and this project was created by Ellen. From her channel's name is Hmm Makeup. So go check her out and I'll have all the information for this project listed down below. So what I first did was I chose six numbers and I, um, no, how many did I do? I think I did three at first and then I decided every month I was going to roll in three more. So I'm currently up to, in one of those, um, numbers had two products inside the box. My advent calendar was filled partly from a friend helping me and then me filling the rest of them. So I don't know what's in every number. Some of the numbers have two products. Most of the numbers just have one. So the first thing that I picked was for number four, and that was my Fenty um, Cake Shake Gloss. And this went from 25 grams to 24.72. So it has gone down a bit, and I'm happy about that. Um, and then the Ulta Lip Gloss in Plum was also in that same box for number four, and it went from 11 to 10.8 grams, which isn't a huge jump, but a little progress every time you'll start using things up. Um, after that, I chose for number 23, my Milk Makeup Highlighter in the shade Turnt. And this has gone from 2.2 centimeters to two centimeters. So I did use 0.2 centimeters. Again, little bit goes a long way and the little bit of progress, it's gonna add up and hopefully I'll finish it. Um, then I chose the Hourglass Veil Translucent Powder. I'm not gonna open this, it'll be a big mess. But this went from 17 grams to 16.53. I've only used it a few times. It's kind of a pain in the butt. So I think what I'm gonna do is finish up one of my larger setting powders and then dump this into the container when that is done so that I can get my brush in it easier because this is a pain in the butt. Um, next up, I chose my Ulta Beauty, this was for number 12. This is the Ulta Beauty Matte Liquid Lipstick and this is in the shade Mauve. So that is the product. It went from nine grams to 8.61. So I have used it quite a bit. Next up is for number 19 and it was my Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss. This was in the shade um, Taffy Tease. This went from 26 to 24.65. So I did pretty darn good with this. I keep this on my vanity and when I'm putting on my makeup, I'll just put it on first and just kind of use it to nourish and hydrate. I really like the Fenty Gloss um, formula. It's, it's very nice. And then finally for number 20, I chose the Becca Soft Light Blurring Powder. I have a ton of powders and projects now. And same thing with the Hourglass one. I'm gonna wait and when one of my larger ones are done. I'm going to dump this into it because it's kind of a pain. And I know I have another hourglass powder in the advent calendar. So I'm going to have a lot of powder to pan and I'm hoping that I can get through all of it this year. So I went through and I did my um, random number generator three times because I decided every month until all the numbers were taken that I was going to choose three products to put into this um, project so that I'm not waiting till the very end and I have a month left to use three products that might be larger. So what I did was I rolled ahead of time and I'll put the pictures up on the screen that I rolled because I use my phone to film so I can't roll the number and film at the same time. I don't know how to do that yet. But anyway, I chose numbers 6, 17, and 18. So let me go to my calendar and I'll pull them out and I'll show you what I chose. So number 6. 17 and 18. So there's 18. I really hope I don't get, I hope I don't get that other hourglass powder. And here's number six. This is a huge box. Six, seven, seven, so I got for 17. No, nope. in the last drawer. Okay, so we have product number six. Oh, it's a twofer. 
So number six, I have my Tresemme mousse. This is a mini mousse, so I will be using that. I'm trying the Curly Girl method. I don't know if this is approved, but I know that other uh, some mousses are. So I'm going to try this one. So I will weigh this and um, let you know where I stand next time. And then the Good Behavior Smoothing Spray. It's a protein spray. It's a frizz control so I'll have to try this as well it's also a heat protectant it's from IGK so I'll have to try this as well so cool so there's a two for that was for number six then I chose um, box number 17 or oh, I shouldn't have jinxed myself all right well now I have another hourglass powder so what I'll do then is I will take both of them and put it into the larger container when I'm done so I'm not even gonna bother weighing that because it stayed exactly the same and then the last box was number 18 this is this sounds really light there's a little tiny thing in there oh it's a lip liner okay I'm not mad at it this is my unique lip liner in the shade what is this it's hard to see Oh man, I'm getting old. Do I have to put my glasses on? Oh, I have to put my glasses on. I used to be able to read things. Oh, purposeful. That's what it is. So here's the shade. It's a really pretty purpley color. So that is that. So good. Okay. So those are my um, products. I'm kind of excited. I'm not excited about this new, uh, this other hourglass one, but at least it's out. It's out of there. I know I'm not going to open it again. Um, so anyway. I'll see you with my next update. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Please, if you like me, sub consider subscribing. It's free. Hit that bell and then all my videos will show up in your notifications so you don't miss one. I do a lot of panning videos and a few get ready with me's as well. And have a great day or night wherever you are. Bye.